<laughs> it's gonna be so much fun. I actually can't eat the next babe. Take me to the beach, babe. Hi, I'm Elma, and we are here in the beautiful Dominican Republic. <laughs> Woo! Yeah! I have come to surprise Diag, Stan, Amber, Courtney, Chloe, and the rest of the gang. So Essex being Essex, everyone knows everyone. So of course I know literally every single soul in Essex, um, which is sometimes a good thing and sometimes not so good. I would like to think everyone's my friend, but I mean, I don't know what people say about me behind my back. So I guess we'll play it by ear, but every, I get on with everyone. I like everyone. So I've known Amber for probably around four years now and I absolutely love the bones of her. I think she's such a special person. So I'm so happy to be here with her. To be honest, I actually don't not get on with anyone, if I'm honest. Like, I genuinely think if you don't get on with me, that's a you problem, not me problem. So I like to think I'm a free spirit. I get on with everyone, but who knows? I love Chloe Brockett. I can't wait to see her. I'm so sad she's not here, but I'll make sure I drink for her as well. I met Chloe um, just through the girls really, just going out, you know, everyone knows everyone, everyone goes to the same places, we do the same things, we drink the same drinks, so that's how I met Chloe, but I absolutely, she's just hilarious. I met her, actually, I met her when we were doing, when it was the, um, the football, I met her then and we just got on like a house on fire. So I'm so in love, it's a joke, it makes me feel a bit sick to my stomach, um, but, you know, just going with the flow, huh? Um, so it's a recent thing and at the minute he's ticked all the boxes and you know it's really difficult to find someone that ticks all the boxes but I think I think this could be my potential husband and if it ain't then I'm it's Diags. I'm going straight for Diags. Oh, I've missed you. Yeah, I've missed you too. How long have you two actually known each other? Like three, four years. You two look good together. He's my bestie. I mean I oh, no. just got bestie on. <laughs> no. <laughs> Uh, Can I be honest? I actually said to Diags I would marry him, and I actually offered to marry him, and he didn't want to marry me. Do you know what? Diags is just my soul partner. We get on so well, and we always had this little agreement that we were going to get married if all else failed. We was going to marry each other, and right. I, but I was in a relationship at the time. So, oh. so, so oh, okay, right. Yeah. So, wrong, wrong time. Wrong time. Right. Right. Wrong time. Right. So now I'm, right. I'm available to and get married. And now I'm not available to get married. Oh. So, so. I'm really happy at the moment, but you never know these things. I've heard actual zero gossip because I've been a surprise. So I've not spoke to anyone, I've not seen anyone, but I can't wait to sit and have a catch up with the girls because I just know, I just know, I can feel it. I can feel it in my bones. That it's going to be so much juicy goss. <laughs> it is going to be so much fun. I actually can't even explain. I think it's just going to be nutty and I think that is just going to be the best way to describe a 60 series. 